actually have a dislike of attempting to define love. Um, we can say love is an attachment-related emotion. That's the sort of scientific jargon term, right, uh, that we're um, through evolution um, uh, programmed or, or, or evolved to respond with love to those who are close to us and particularly to our, our children and our, our infants. Um, and this is adaptive because um, uh, it motivates attachment and that, that motivates us to take care of these small creatures that are born into the world really about nine months premature. Uh, human beings are such that, that we're born nine, essentially nine months premature. And if we didn't have love, we wouldn't be motivated to be attached to these wee creatures that need to be held in a kind of social womb for up to a year after they're born. So that tells you why we have love. Um, and of course, you can say uh, that people have come up with lots of different kinds of love and definitions of love. Um, and that's, that's all very fine and well. Um, but the um, you know, difference between agape and romantic love and you know, all those different things, um, I just find them a little bit arbitrary and beside the point. Um, yeah, so that's, so I think love is something that we um, in some ways need to let alone and, um, um, and really see as essentially about um, what happens between a, an infant and a caregiver and what happens between partners in an intimate relationship. Um, that's really, I think, why we have love. The rest of it is kind of complicated spinnings out from those places.